Virgos, 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 Virgos. All right, Virgos, let's see. What messages do we have for Virgos? What messages do we have for Virgos? Oh, that one to jump. Okay. We have getting to know each other. So as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond is going to deepen. All right. So maybe there's someone that you're getting to know. Maybe you guys are going to decide on whether or not if you want to give this relationship a chance or not. Okay. There could be lots of playfulness involved. There could be children involved. And it could also be um, finances and career involved as well. Okay. You guys could be focused in on your family life. All right. So let's take a look. I'm sorry if it sounds like I'm banging these cards, but I'm not banging them. They're just a fresh deck, and that's just how it sounds. <laughs> All right. Do keep in mind, Virgos, these are general reads, okay? So they won't resonate with every single Virgo. If it resonates, leave me a thumbs up. Comment, share, and... If you're new to the channel, subscribe. All right. So I want to know, is there someone new that Virgo is trying to get to know? What's going on with Virgos for the month of April? We got the lovers at the bottom of the deck and the two of cups. Okay, so this is definitely um, some type of love thing here, an intimate relationship. Okay, so some of you guys could be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or there is a Gemini involved. Okay, let's see. Okay, the first card we have is the nine of earth, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn is the energy, but some of you guys are possibly feeling like you're single or you're really, really focused in on taking care of yourself and being independent. Okay, so with the four of sword, I mean the four of wands. Okay, this is about home life and this is having stability. So I feel like some of you guys are more focused on stability and you're making that clear. This is something that has been made clear that you guys are focusing on your home life, okay? Taking care of yourself and taking care of your home life. You're looking for stability, okay? Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius involved with this Ace of Air, okay? But we got the Knight of Water. So there has been some type of invitation or communication. Um, and this goes with making something clear, okay? Something has been made very clear here that you're focused on yourself and you're focused on your stability. Okay. I feel like in the past, some of you guys possibly isolated yourself and did some deep, deep um, reevaluation and um, have done some soul searching. We have the Hermit card, which is the card of Virgo. And I do feel like... Um, there was definitely a lot of uh, a significant life event, okay? There's some type of life experience um, that you needed to go through. I do feel like this could have possibly been like a karmic situation, um, something about, you know, a lesson being learned, okay? There was some type of lesson that was learned in the past, okay? And I do feel um, that you guys possibly took some time and went into hermit mode, and did that soul searching, okay? And has come out to this realization about the situation, okay? I feel like there's either things are going to pick up. Things are going to start picking up. Um, or there's some type of communication coming in, 
Okay, we got King of Earth, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like this is communication. Maybe some of you guys are communicating with a uh, Earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. If not, they carry that type of energy. Um, they may um, be very well financially. Um, they could be very business or goal oriented. Okay, but I do feel like uh, finances are either going to pick up or some of you guys are communicating with a uh, big uh, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like there's going to be changes, okay? I feel like some changes, a positive change, okay? A, sudden, a situation suddenly starts to move forward and then fortune becomes more so on your side. This is the will, okay? The will is spinning and the circumstances begin to change. And I feel like um, they'll be changing for the better. And then when I pull a clarifier here, we have the three of fire, Okay. So this is abundance, okay? Things start looking very good. Um, just have patience. But I do feel like some of you guys are waiting for things to change going into the near future, okay? Some of you guys are really definitely focused in, make things very clear that you are focused in on your resources. We got a ten of earth, so you're focused in on your money. Some of you definitely went through a very life-changing experience, okay? Some of you guys really um, went into hermit mode, and some of you guys took that time to come to some type of uh, conclusion or realization that you need to focus more on yourself and your stability. Okay, we got Night of Fire. I feel like... Um, this is temporary. This is like back and forth. So maybe you've been communicating with somebody, going back and forth with somebody. And I do feel like there is definitely a re-evaluation, a review of a situation um, and moving things in a new direction. I feel like some of you guys are either waiting for things to turn around. You've already placed in things. You've, I feel like a lot of you have already placed in exactly what it is that you want. You're not wavering away from what you want at all. You've made things very clear how things are going to go, how things are going to be. Um, and you communicated that. And this person is really getting to know a different side of you. Okay. Maybe this is something that you don't normally show them. But I do feel like there is definitely going to be a really big turnaround um, coming in the near future. Okay. I do, do feel like resources um, are going to change. I do feel like there is this really big reevaluation of how things are going to go in the near future. So it, everything looks good going into the near future. Okay. It looks good. I feel like you guys have gotten it together on your stability and where what you want out of life. Okay, maybe you, some of you guys had to take some time off to work for yourself to think about what it is exactly how you want things to go. But congratulations, I do see things changing and circumstances getting better. Okay, the wheel is going to spin and it's spinning and more so in your favor. All right, so I hope this reading was helpful for you guys. That was really quick and straight to the point. But I do want to let you guys know for... Um, if you want to book your very own personal reading, that information is in the drop box and I will be going live um, on YouTube. They are going to be donation based readings. So if you catch me live, you can donate and get you a reading on the spot. OK, thank you guys so much for tuning in with me and I'll see you guys later. Ciao for now.